even while eating at home is typically less expensive than dining out, there are always methods to cut costs even more when cooking your own food. Some of these time-saving tips take a bit more effort, but the rewards include more flavor and more money in your pocket. On the other hand, if you're constantly on the go, home tasks can feel overwhelming and difficult. The last thing you probably want to do is spend more time in the kitchen after spending so much time cooking and cleaning. Want to stop wasting food? Want to buy groceries for less money? Why not do both, yeah? Worry no more, because in today's video, we'll list down and talk about these amazing kitchen hacks. Number 1. Give bananas a longer life by wrapping them Wrapping the bunches end with plastic wrap will help keep the bananas fresher for longer. Separate each banana if possible. Both strategies prevent ethylene gases from escaping from the stem, causing the fruit to mature too quickly. Number 2. Keep your berries fresh for up to two weeks What's the best way to keep your berries tasty and fresh than ever? In a bowl, combine the berries, one cup of vinegar, and three cups of cold water. Let it sit for 10 minutes. After a thorough rinsing and drying, place the items in a container lined with paper towels, cover it, and store it. Excellent for two weeks. Number 3. Save cut fruit from browning Apple slices can appear appealing if a little lemon juice is added, as you've probably heard. Similar results can be obtained by mixing one part honey to two parts water to prevent fruit from browning. Have you ever wondered how this works? The oxidation process that results in discoloration is slowed down by the citric acid, vitamin C, and protein in lemon juice, as well as honey. Alternatively, you can also do it with salt, ideal for meal prepping and slicing your apples, as well as other fruits for the week. Slice the apples and toss them in a bowl with cold water and one to two tablespoons of salt. Allow to soak for five minutes. After rinsing, put the food in a covered container and the refrigerator. Number four, prevent sugar from hardening. For instance, when you attempt to prepare cookies, you discover that the brown sugar has hardened into clumps of crust or a single rock-hard candy mountain. Put some orange peel or an apple slice in an airtight jar with the brown sugar to keep it moist and scoopable. Alternatively, you can quickly repair the problem by microwaving brown sugar with a tiny glass of water. The block of sugar will be broken up with the help of the moisture the water discharged into the microwave. Some others even attempted to put a slice of loaf in the jar of the hardened sugar. Did it work? Why don't you check it out? Number 5. Get creative with covering food Probably a new invention to many, shower caps are renowned for being hair hacks, but their uses go beyond just protecting your luscious locks from the elements. To prevent airborne contaminants from causing food to spoil, cover leftovers with a clean cap while they're still on their plates. Disgusting? Well, it's a hack, and as long as you use a clean one, it doesn't have to be a problem. Shower caps are much simpler than continuously removing and replacing plastic wrap or tin foil because they are reusable, and when you see them in your fridge, you could find yourself giggling. Number 6. Skim the fat with ice By skimming a few ice cubes wrapped in a paper towel or cheesecloth, along the surface of the liquid, you can remove extra fat from stocks, stews, and sauces. Ice aids in the fat's solidification, making it simpler to scoop up with a spoon. Number 7. Steam clean your microwave It's simpler than you might think to steam clean your microwave. Simply split a lemon in half, then put each half in a bowl or jug of water that can be microwaved. Put the bowl in the microwave for 3 minutes to reheat. Allow the bowl to stand for 5 minutes after that. This produces steam, which, when combined with a lemon and natural degreaser, aids in removing dried-on food and stains from inside your microwave. Simply wipe it away once you remove the bowl. Number 8. Roll those lemons Roll citrus fruit on a hard surface before cutting it open to get more juice. Roll the lemon firmly on a chopping board or counter before cutting it if you need fresh lemon juice for salad dressing or a great lemonade. This will provide nearly twice as much juice. Number 9. Don't be annoyed having eggshells in your cupcake again Nobody likes cake or brownies with crunchy bits in them. However, trying to fish out an eggshell fragment that has rolled into the batter can become a fruitless endeavor because it evades your grasp like a cunning tadpole. Simply wet your fingers and tap on the eggshell. Don't believe it? Why don't you try? Use half of your previously cracked egg to pick up shards of shattered eggshell for a cleaner solution. Without wasting too much egg, the shell functions as a magnet to attract up shell bits. Number 10. Peel boiled eggs in a big batch It's time to peel all those eggs in a shake. Put all your eggs in one pot or container. Shaking several hard-boiled eggs in any container with a lid will allow you to peel them all at once. Boom, bang, shake, 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 and smash. Shells have already cracked and are ready to be shaken off. 
Even though the eggs won't look as pretty, using this method will make making an egg salad a lot quicker. Number 11. Keep your herbs fresh for up to a month. This method works best with parsley, cilantro, and other herbs. Trim and clean the ends. Dry completely. Place them in a jar with water that is half full. Remember, half full. They will last one to two weeks in the refrigerator as well, but if you place a plastic bag or stash a bag on top, they will last for about a month. Number 12. Remove skin from potatoes without a peeler. Run a knife carefully around the potato's perimeter, not from top to bottom, but around the center of the potato. Just enough to cut the skin, not the potato, should be cut during the incision. Boil the potato next. Afterwards, once it is boiled, put it in an ice bath. Once the skin has separated from the potato, you can remove it easily by picking it off. Number 3. Make hard-boiled eggs in the oven Wait, hard-boiled eggs with an oven? What a horrendous idea! Maybe not so horrendous in some way. Whatever the cause, there are occasions when boiling eggs on the stove isn't the ideal option. Perhaps you can't be bothered to watch over a pot of boiling eggs, or perhaps you need to cook a large number of them at once. For this reason, using the oven is a fantastic alternative. Put the eggs in the muffin pan with their shells on. Then bake them for about 30 minutes at 350 degrees. You no longer need to keep an eye on a pot as they bake. You may be off doing anything else. And rather than having to prepare them in smaller batches, as you would probably have to if you were going to make them on the stove, you can simply produce a dozen of these eggs at once. Number 4. Prevent onions from making you cry like you're in a drama movie Before slicing, freeze this aromatic vegetable to prevent onion tears. This approach only works if you intend to sauté the onions afterward, otherwise the raw chunks will become a little bit more mushy once the onion thaws. Or, to protect your eyes as you chop, strap on your swimming goggles. No? Alternatively, you can place a slice of bread in your mouth, with a portion of it hanging out to absorb the irritating gas before it hits your eyes, if you want to seem really insane when your roommate walks in. And last but not least, number 15. Get shredded chicken using your standing mixer. You don't have to burn your fingers trying to shred chicken with forks. It can be done in a matter of minutes. Simply add the cooked chicken to your mixer and mix it with the paddle attachment for a few minutes. After that, you may easily enjoy chicken that has been shred. What do you think about these kitchen hacks? Oh, for sure at least one of these ideas is perfect for you. Do you also have a hack of yours that you want to share? Let us know in the comments below. If you want more content related to this topic, make sure to check our channel. Take care, and we'll see you in the next video.